Well, hello there, New Day family, friends. This is Pastor Adam, and it's time for the news. So let's have a look at what's going on right here at New Day Church. Christmas is coming. Hope you guys had... Uh, Christmas is coming. Christmas has happened. And uh, hope you guys have uh, an awesome holiday. And if this is a hard time for you, just want you to know that we are aware and we are praying. So, uh, yeah, there's, there's a comforter who is in... Uh, in the person of Jesus who knows and who is acquainted with suffering and and uh, just know that you're not alone this season. So yeah, we love you. We're standing with you. So that said, here's a look at what's going on at New Day. So uh, we've got some, we got some craziness going on as, as uh, our Christmas week and our, our New Year's stuff happens. So December 25th and 26th, Monday and Tuesday, the, today and tomorrow, our offices are going to be closed for the holidays. So uh, you can come in then on the 27th, which is Wednesday, if you have any New Day Church business to take care of, and our office will be open. And then there is not going to be any dinner for King's Kids or J-Gen or King's Kids or J-Gen on December 27th and January 3rd. So our Wednesday night activities are on hiatus for the holiday for the next two weeks for the 27th and the 3rd. So mark that down. The 10th will be the next time that we have King's Kids at J-Gen. We have King's Kids Kids and J-Gen Kids in King's Kids and J-Gen. There we go. So that's some of the schedule stuff. Uh, here's a look at pretty much our entire week is on break for this session. So here's a look at what we've got coming up. Uh, we've got giving statements and, and year-end giving. So did, did you know that you can update your info and see the amounts through our church database, which is called Breeze? Uh, newday-church.org slash Breeze. You also have through December 31st to contribute financially for your tax deduction and your offerings to New Day. And you can go to newday-church.org slash giving to give online or mail in with a postmark by December 31st. So that's new in, new new day, new day year and giving stuff. So that's fun. Uh, we're going to do some dessert for the Minneapolis Police Department on December 29th. So you can drop off at the church here to some, on December 29th. We need about 15 pans of bars. Uh, no mess, non-sticky, not crazy bars. Uh, just something simple to, to feed the Minneapolis Police Department. We're going to donate the Christmas bars for their Christmas party. So uh, you can drop them off at the church. Our doors are open from 1030 to 430 on December 29th. So that's fun. Uh, just worship. We're going to have a night of of just worship on uh, Monday, January 1st. So we're going to worship in the new year, worshiping New Year Day, New Year's Day at 7 p.m. together. So come join us on January 1st, Monday, January 1st, as we worship together. So uh, we've got a family blessing Sunday on January 7th. So our 9 a.m. service will be our annual family blessing service. So be aware of that as you come. Uh, join us in person or online through YouTube if possible. And uh, we're going to have some blessing teams that will be set up to pray for those of, us, those of you who are joining us in person. So it's our yearly family blessing. And uh, we'll make a way for you watching online too to be able to be blessed. So Pastor Christopher will, will he's always kind of cook something up for the online crowd. So can't be here just know that you're not going to miss out completely so uh revelation wellness then is going to kick off on january 8th it is a faith-based training for your mind body and spirit uh, you can join us mondays for nine weeks starting at 5 p.m with a book study and then there's going to be a workout doing some body movement and the book is uh revelation wellness by elisa keaton and the book is book and the course are fifty dollars. If you already own the book, then the cost of coming is only thirty. So that's fun. If you've done Rev well before, you have the book. Show up for show up for less. Uh, January fourteenth on Sunday at eleven fifteen p.m. after our service, we are going to undeck the halls. So that's our annual uh, Christmas decoration. Uh, storage, put away, tear down kind of thing that we do each year <clears throat> as we transition from Christmas decorations to winter decor. That's fun. Uh, January 14th, mark your calendars for that. That's always fun. We'll probably have some, some fun stuff going on and we're going to have lunch provided. So there's that. Uh, women's retreat, we've been talking about it. Don't wait till the last minute. You will miss out. January 22nd through the 24th, there's just a few spots left and you can contact Pastor Kelly with more questions. And then uh, the Veterans Memorial Snow Removal is a January volunteer opportunity that's being headed up by Pastor Christopher. 
Uh, if you would like to be a part of that, removing snow during the month of January, whenever it snows from the Veterans Memorial, in, right next to Memorial Park here in New Prague, uh, contact Pastor Christopher, have a shovel ready and some warm winter gear, and we will get together and joyfully remove some snow. So that's fun. So those are the news, those are the events, those are the things going on as December, uh, as Christmas comes and goes, and as the new year comes, and as the days get longer, and as spring approaches, uh, we're just, we love you, and we're so thankful for you being part of our family, and uh, we wish you the best. Happy Holidays. <laughs>